Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and uh, this is a quick tips and tricks video. Works also for Microsoft Edge. The only difference is that in Microsoft Edge the uh, results will come from Bing. If you use the Google Chrome web browser, uh, one of the features that um, is very useful if you have, you're reading a text, looking at something, want to have more information about something that you've seen, well, you can simply highlight a word, highlight a phrase, highlight a name, and what you'll do is once you highlight it by clicking and holding the left click button while you actually go over it with your mouse or um, your trackpad, right click on the highlighted name or word or friend or sentence or whatever, and you can click, you can choose, choose search Google for whatever you've chosen it's going to come out in search results that you can actually look at in a separate tab so it don't you don't lose your main tab you don't lose your main article or whatever you've been doing which is nice and can actually be very useful if you're doing research for example and uh, so this is working and works great for google chrome like i said in edge it, it's going to work but it's different so for example, Edge already has a panel. So let's go and take the same thing here. We're gonna go into uh, choose San Francisco like I did. Here in Edge, one of the advantages that you'll have in Edge that Chrome doesn't have, there's a search that already is here. You can click that and on a panel on the, le on the right side, you'll see a little search panel come up if you want, but you can of course, like in uh, Chrome, right click, and then in here, search for San Francisco. And here is going to bring you search results. Way different than what you have with Chrome because, once again, Bing is the main search engine edge. But in Chrome, you are using Google Chrome as the engine for the search. So a little tips and tricks here that you can use. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.